what is going on guys welcome back to the channel and guys today we are back with another video guys today i will be showing you guys how to install and run exe files on linux slash chromebook so be sure to leave a like subscribe and turn on all post notifications if you guys don't want to miss a video and let's get straight into it but before we get into it um i just want to say uh, a couple of things first off we are at 381 subscribers and i do want to reach 400 subscribers and um yeah i will be trying my best to upload every single time i get free time uh i know it's been slow um because i have school and i've been focusing on it ever since but trust me it's gonna be worth it at the end i will be able to upload a lot um but yeah this at least i'm considering this as a break um but uh yeah uh, that's basically all i wanted to say um just that it's, I'll be uploading more soon, um, but anyway, moving on, let's get straight into the video. Just quick disclaimer, um, for those who are on Chromebook, you guys do need Linux developer mode uh, or beta mode uh, to access the terminal. So if you want to do that, just go to settings right here, scroll down, advanced developers linux development environment and then you can turn it on uh, technically it should be here you can turn it on from there um, and you need to install it okay so after that's done um you guys need to go ahead and go over to crossover um if this is not the first link then the website is codeweavers.com and so click on it there we go you will be brought to this page right here we want to click to crossover and then we want to click on Linux because that's what we're on so free trial of course you don't need to pay anything this is completely free and so here you just need to enter your name and email then go ahead and download the file uh, it will be a Debian file and you do need to move it to your Linux and then install it from there uh, in, in your Linux distro. Um, but after you've installed the application, you you can open the app. And so this is what it's probably going to look like. Um, of course, you can see Steam on here. It says limited functionality and World of Warcraft. So remember, this isn't for only programs, but it also works for games. Um, like me, I've uh, I've been playing Salt and Sanctuary on here, um, and so yeah. Assuming that you've already installed the application that you want, the program or whatever, go into install an unlisted application right here. This is gonna pop up. You can click install right here. Now, what you want here is to click on the exe file you want to run the application. I will not be doing that because I already have it. And then after you select it, it's going to ask you to install. It's going to say something like this. Um, new bottle name. All you want to do is just put a name um, of the program or something memorable. So when you go inside the application, you can see here what is what. So you don't get confused. So after that, uh, it's going to be installed, it's going to say installed, and it's going to bring you to this page. After you're in this page, it's very simple. The hard part is over. You need to go to run command, browse, and you're going to do literally the same thing you just did two seconds ago. You're going to select the application you want to run. So for me, now I know it's going to be confusing for those people who have Linux. This is clearly not Windows. So what you're going to do is go to home and go to where you downloaded it. So for me, it'd be here, 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 and then I'd select this folder and then click open. So I'm going to select that, click open. And then it's very simple. It's very simple. All you need to do is click run and it will run. Just to demonstrate, I will be running it. And so it's gonna look it's gonna look a little bit like this. Now some programs, some games could break 
uh if you want to switch tabs oh yeah there we go oh wait a minute i really hope Oh well, okay. I hope my progress is saved, guys, because uh, I did a failed attempt at this before and it did not turn out well. I hope my progress is definitely saved. Hold on. Fix this. Options. Aim. Where is it? Hold up. Where is it? Uh, not controls. Not... Oh, no, it's not game. Hold up. It's video. My bad. It's a video. There we go. Full screen. Apply. There we go. Oh, wow. The game. Glitching. What is going on? Oh, no. It is glitching. Oh my god, my game is gone. No. No, my game. It's completely gone. I'm so angry. Alright, well this is basically how I run uh, the game. Besides that me being very angry. This is how you run the game. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys want to see more videos just like this one. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.